one county clerk here in the Hudson Valley is holding firm on a no decision when it comes to supplying the names of people that hold pistol permits to the Journal News. The paper has already published this interactive map for thousands of permit holders in Westchester and Rockland. But as News 12's Robert Wolf reports, Putnam County says it will not be a part of it. These are innocent people who legal gun owners, who their names and addresses are going to be put all over the newspaper. Why? Betsy Rose, a mail pack with her protest sign in hand, came to the historic Putnam County Courthouse in Carmel Thursday to say she's backing the Putnam County Clerk Dennis Sant's decision not to release the names of pistol permit holders who live in the county to the Journal News. We're not talking about the rule of law anymore. We're talking about endangering our citizens. Last week, the paper published this interactive map, which shows the names and addresses of tens of thousands of gun permit holders in Westchester and Rockland counties. The information was obtained under the Freedom of Information Act. The paper's editor said that the public has a right to know where guns are in the aftermath of the Sandy Hook Elementary School massacre. But Sant says this is a right of privacy issue for people who have followed the law to the letter. I'm refusing because I could not live with myself if one of my pistol permit holders in Putnam County had to face a dangerous situation. Putnam County Executive Mary Ellen O'Dell says she's backing her county clerk's decision 100%. And I want every citizen in Putnam County to know I will not retreat from protecting you, nor will I surrender. And State Senator Greg Ball says he's pushing legislation to prevent such publication in the future. Let's make sure that this is a wake-up call and no other paper ever does this again. News 12 did try and contact the Journal News for comment. Our phone call was not returned. The sentiment here is even though something may be legal to do, it may not be the right thing to do. We're in Carmel. Robert Wolf, News 12. And the Putnam County Executive tells News 12 that any initial legal action by the paper against the county clerk will be handled by the county's law department. 